Hey guys, how are we doing today? Just, I am a large fan of Rune Shark. I've actually written them messages in the past, asked them to do videos with me. Uh, clearly they've said no, but they've decided to do a little challenge that I feel I have a small chance at maybe not succeeding, but coming in top three. So, um, what it is, is back from hack. Now, if you guys don't know this, I've actually been hacked in the past a total of five times, one of which the person was a douche and dropped just about 2k crimson charms and about 1k blues uh, so it was pretty bad pretty bad indeed um, so I'm actually I have a bit of experience when it comes to uh, building back from a hack so I decided this would be a really good thing to do here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna show this little timer over here and um, the thing about it is the fact that I am not allowed to have videos longer than one uh, than 15 minutes on YouTube so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start now and when I do start I'll start at two minutes so I have a little bit of time to talk to you guys and we'll just subtract two minutes and I'm going to fast forward keeping this on screen at all times so you know I'm not cheating when it comes to the time and uh, Simon, James if you guys are watching this I love you guys keep tuned and uh, yeah so from now on I'm gonna try to commentate and I'm sorry if this is getting annoying I'm gonna try to commentate uh, it's not going to be live commentating right now. This is live commentary, and uh, we've got 30 seconds to go. Now, um, I haven't really spent much time. I've spent about 10 minutes thinking of a of a plan to do here, and um, yeah. So, wish me luck, guys. I may not win. I'm almost positive I'm not going to win, but I figure it'd be interesting and at least worth trying. So, uh, if anything, guys, uh, wish me luck. So, we're gonna start off in two. I love you guys, and I'll be right, right guys, back never mind with the uh, two-minute setback thing. I decided to just start off with a completely new clip. So here we are, attacking men. I actually got the idea from James from Moonshark. And the uh, funny thing is, he mentioned getting a dwarf weed on the first couple of kills, which is funny, because I actually did get a dwarf weed on the first couple of kills, so that was nice. Uh, that was able to start me off with a good 4K. So immediately afterwards, I decided to used that money and I went ahead and bought a games necklace and a terrorbird pouch. I actually bought two but I ended up not using the second one anyway so it didn't really matter too much. I took myself over to the red dragons to collect a few white berries. The price of white berries used to be actually substantially worth picking up uh, until the bots absolutely crashed it to a shutter. Uh, I actually did end up getting PJ'd by a red dragon uh, to the point where I was forced to leave. So I ended up buying a bunch of team camps which are actually worth bank at around 1k each and you could buy them for around 300 GP each. So um, I decided to pick up a couple of those on the way over. And uh, at this point I was actually still kind of winging it. This was pretty much my first time I didn't really uh, think of my plan very well. Uh, but I had this idea of using block and going over to bot kill. Uh, I figure Green Dragons is good enough money as it is, so, you know, killing bots that have already pretty much uh, killed the dragons for you would be a lot better. Uh, taking down one big dragon for multiple bones is a lot better than taking down a thousand little ones for a thousand little bones. So here you can see me running over with pretty much nothing but a dragon, da dragon dagger and 20 teleblock runes and a few lobsters, so it's a bit bit interesting really, the only kind of strength bonus I had was a strength enemy which I felt was absolutely necessary. Um, it's a bit difficult killing these bots, I have to admit. Uh, something cool that I, I like here, now the thing is when it comes to killing these bots, it's a bit like fighting revs, if you've ever fought revs you know what I mean. Uh, if you stop for just a second to eat, bear in mind look at my HP, boom down to 94 and thankfully the bot runs away. <sighs> Could have ended my life there. Uh, anyways. Uh, if you've ever fought a uh, rev, you know exactly what what I mean. Where if you eat once, you pretty much have the chance of losing it because these bots eat so fast, you have to risk it. So in this situation, I had to risk it. So I, I was low health, and decided to protect from item in case this went bad. I spec'd it out, very low HP at 100. Spec'd it out, walks away with the kill on 7 HP. That was crazy. Just felt like I deserved to put that in there. Uh, there was actually a Rambo spec, I believe it was like 600, 
uh, which is pretty damn awesome considering I was unpotted and not a large strength bonus, so having that with a DDS is pretty awesome. I didn't end up putting that in there because I couldn't find it, didn't really look too hard anyways in the first place. So uh, we've already made it up to around 20 minutes-ish, and uh, I wish I'd show my money pouch at this point. Uh, you didn't really see it there, but I ended up buying 50 raw lobs uh, 50 lobsters, and uh, I should have said this in the beginning of the video, or at least showed this. Uh, you probably were hopefully able to see it there. I bought 50 lobsters, and I only had one lobster banked. So essentially, I was just pretty much taking out all but one lobster, and it was pretty much having as if I never had any in the first place. So that's what I decided to do. Um, ended up using a dragon longsword, hoping it would increase my kills per hour but it wasn't and instead decided to just use the dragon dagger anyways because of the high uh, speed of the dragon dagger I use the dragon longsword every once in a while but always end up reverting back to the dragon dagger yes the timer of Cantasia Studio was extremely frustrating having to move it around constantly because it would always block something uh, it was a lot harder to work with than I thought it would be but nonetheless I digressed and um yeah, thankfully I didn't run into any PKers along the lines, although something I really want to say is the fact that this is definitely not going to be my first attempt. I mean, my last attempt. This is definitely my first attempt at this um, <clears throat> little, what's it, back from the hack? Back, back from the hack, something like that along the lines. And um, definitely this is not going to be the last time that I try. I'm really interested in this series. I really do like this series, so uh, this is pretty much my first attempt, and I'm definitely going to see what other kind of things I can pull along here. Um, now, we have a little bit of a problem around the end, but around the end is when I'll get into it. Uh, I want to bear in mind, James or Simon, if you guys are listening to me right now, I'm pretty sure I've already established this, but I'm a big fan and would love to make a video with you guys. <clears throat> Just, you know, throwing that in there. Anyways, getting back on point. <laughs> Yeah, if you guys are one of my subscribers, not Simon or James, I want to apologize for not making a video uh, recently. Uh, the reason for that is that my bank has been really, really bad as of the moment. Practically got hacked myself, and uh, I've been thinking, I've been trying to think of ideas that I can make for videos uh, that are interesting to watch, and at the same time, uh, don't really hurt my bank extremely. Like I know you guys love to watch me fail and go PKing in Derok even though I'm mainly PVM but um, I can't really do that all the time because I'm really risking my bank just for a one minute clip so here I decided to sell my weapons the dragon dagger and longsword what my what I had bought a Karasi for the last 10 minutes of the clip and I figured it would help out a lot so here I am buying supers <coughs> which I should have done from the very first place now I've only got around 8 minutes just about six minutes actually left only three lobsters left one prayer pot left I was just curious on how many kills I can get uh, my war tortoise was just about to die at any moment there I failed in my Karasi spec but pretty much uh, succeeded with just combos so there's two kills already wasn't that bad I was go going pretty fast uh, you guys are about to see the problem pretty soon um, but anyways guys I'm sorry for not making a video for that for, for a while, so yeah, I am back though. <laughs> Anyways, so here's where the problem was. <clears throat> I'm just about to hit one hour. I'm comboing this girl. Just a couple seconds left. Five, four, and I killed her. So technically right there, I earned the money. So technically I earned the money right there. So I decided I was only right that I did loot it. So after I had looted it, um, completely because I technically did earn the money if you found that money on the floor you would definitely pick it up so um, decided I'd loot the grave and would tell you over to the bank to see how much money it is total that I've made uh, to be completely honest I was I'm gonna say I guess not disappointed but shocked at the amount that I made uh, I definitely didn't make as much as I was have I, I was planning on making so here I am. I was thinking about picking the end ties, but I was like, oh, actually, I have a couple of those already. Uh, so here I am with this. <sighs> Come on alongside here. 
And I did not collect that 2,000 coins. I know it did look like it, but I didn't. Uh, that was from an offer from outside of this uh, little episode here. So I decided throughout the entire episode not to pick it up just because that 2K could possibly mean the difference between first and second place. So uh, here I am. And I was pretty confused at the number there. Now, that's pretty much everything. So I was really confused that it only came up to around 300k. So I was wondering, hmm, did the Karasi get counted as 250k? And then I saw there, yes, it actually did. So, uh, wow. Then decided, uh, I still have that 66k in my inventory, and maybe that'll matter a little bit. So I decided to note one of the Dragon Bones to make one space. And I withdraw one mil from here. Um, 66k from here, sorry and do a total check on how much I'm currently worth and I have made 445k within this one hour from nothing so this is my first attempt at the series thank you for watching have an awesome day and this is definitely not my last attempt and uh, I love you guys